Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. In today's video, guys, we're going to show you what can cause code P1128, guys. And we'll demonstrate on 2.4 multi air engine. That, air, uh, that engine, guys, it's actually used in many multiple, guys, Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, Fiat vehicles. You can find that engine in Dodge Dart, Chrysler 200, Jeep Cherokee, Jeep Renegade, Jeep Compass, Fiat 500X, and Fiat Tow Lighting as well, guys. So, if you have a 2.4 multi air engine, you have code P1128, stay with us and we'll explain what can cause that. Quick introduction guys, every single car we get at the shop, we make at least 200 videos. Why? Simply because our mission at the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video guys, hopefully you will find the information helpful. Now, if you guys need to buy any replacement parts too, check out the link in the description of the video below guys, we share it for your convenience, so please check it out. Now. Let me show you guys what we have here. This is the engine that I'm talking about. Scanner usually that we use to scan the system. Okay, is uh, this scanner right here. I want to explain guys what we actually removed and replaced. So we fixed that code. So we're going to cover that today. This is the 2.4 multi air engine guys. Now I have to grab something, a special tool that I need. Okay, right here. And let me show you guys what can cause that. Now, there is four possibilities that can cause that code and we're going to cover all that today. So, now guys, the most common reason to have that code is having a bad oxygen sensor. And most of the time guys, it's caused by an upstream oxygen sensor. What is an upstream oxygen sensor? This is oxygen sensor one guys. Or this is the sensor before the catalytic converter on that 2.4 engine guys. This guy right here, this is the upstream oxygen sensor. Now, this sensor guys, okay, will be super hot. Check it out, don't touch guys. The, uh, work on your vehicle only after the vehicle cooled for at least one night, I would recommend, and then work on it. Radiator fan is here, it can cut your hands off, so be very careful guys. And the most common reason is a bad oxygen sensor. If you need to buy one, we'll have the link in the description of the video below, all we have to do guys. Okay, disconnect it from here. Okay, get the cable out. There is a special tool that you use to remove the sensors. It's not very expensive at all, but definitely guys makes the job way easier. Go ahead, get it on the sensor and just use a ratchet and get it loose. Now if you want to see the replacement video, we have it on the channel, everything from start to finish. This is our replacement sensor, the one that is actually good. And we're guys, okay, uh, we already replaced it. We have the video, as I said, but what else guys, okay, can cause that code? This is not the only guys thing that can cause that code. Another thing guys, if the engine does not give enough fuel, okay, if it doesn't get enough fuel and the fuel filter, okay, we have a video uh, about Dodge Dart fuel filter location and replacement, check it out guys, it's actually hidden, if the fuel filter is plugged up, the car will not be getting enough gas and as a result guys, when it doesn't get enough gas, I want to, uh, okay, let me remove that cover so I can explain a few more things. When it doesn't get enough gas, guys, it's going to struggle and it can, guys, cause that cold again. Okay, because it thinks it's not getting enough fuel, guys, as a result. Fuel injectors are on the back side. We have a video on the channel that explains about that as well. Another thing, guys, it could be a weak fuel pump, bad fuel pump module. Or it could be, guys, problem, okay, problem with the engine computer, okay with the engine computer right here. Sometimes th that could happen as well, guys. We've had uh, something like that happen in the past that we replaced almost everything we can think of. It was just a computer, some diode or something like that was burned inside. We sent it for repair and it was repaired immediately, guys. So hopefully, guys, the video will be helpful to any of you trying to figure that code out. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to your channel for more videos and see you guys next time.